I want to welcome you to the Ask Jeff YouTube channel. Here's today's question. Do you think any of the events of Revelation have already occurred? I've heard that some people think 666 refers to Nero. Now, for those of you who are veterans to the Ask Jeff channel, I'm going to give you one of my favorite statements in regards to end time events. Here it goes. There is nothing that has to happen before Jesus comes back for us. There's a whole lot that has to happen before Jesus comes back with us. Some of the things that have to happen before Jesus comes back with us may in fact happen before Jesus comes back for us. Why is that statement so important? Because on these issues, whether it's 666, Mark of the Beast, whatever it is, I think we have a natural tendency to get in this prophetic mindset that Jesus can't or won't come back until these things occur. And so I think we need to look at the distinction between him calling both the dead and alive together with him and the physical return of us with him. Now, that being said, do I believe that some of the events of Revelation have already occurred? Now, the specific mention was the famous 666, the mark of the beast, Revelation 13, 16 through 18, that says it will be in the right hand or in the forehead. And the question alluded to Nero. We have tried to define 666 a thousand different ways throughout time. And uh, what some have said, particularly with Nero, is what we call a preterist perspective, is that the events of Revelation, as far as the vials and the plagues and the seals, actually took place in the first century AD and are a, quote, type of the events future, not necessarily a futuristic literal interpretation thereof. I wouldn't go that far. I would say that Nero was a type of the person whom the Antichrist will be. In other words, rather than looking at some of the events in Revelation and say they've already happened, we can look at the first century and say some of the things that occurred in the first century were a figure or a type of things that will actually literally be fulfilled as the Bible describes in Revelation. When you get to chapter 6, that famous tribulation time period uh, with the famous seven seals, there's been a whole lot of horrific events that have happened on planet Earth, but none exactly as are written in those chapters. Great question. If you have one, send it to askjeff.net. Maybe your question will be tomorrow. Thanks for being a part of today's daily question. Now, we answer a question each and every day. Please feel free to submit a new question at askjeff.net. We may not have gotten to yours today, but we eventually will continue to be a part of this. Subscribe so you don't miss out on a question every day.